and this is the astrological forecast for the sign of Virgo for March 2017, brought to you by the wonderful people at AskTheAnswer.com, the UK's leading website for tarot readers, psychics, mystics and channelers. Most of you are in a pretty good state this month. The exception here is those of you born from about, say, the 17th to the 20th of September, Saturn squaring your sun and you're under a degree of pressure at the moment. And you're being asked to weed and prune and streamline. And this is just a few of you and it's not going to last long, just a couple of months. But if you're one of these people, then stay below the radar screen and, and get your priorities right. For all of you, it's a fairly industrious month. There's certainly a lot of creative energy out there and a lot of physical energy to spare as well. But um, it's, it's much more of a doing month than it is a communicating month. Mercury's in your opposite sign for the first half of the month. And this could cause problems when dealing with individuals at the one to one level. You're not going to get your message across and be clearly and uh, clearly listened to. You might be heard, but you won't be listened to. So there's, there's a need to actually speak louder than words. So if you need to communicate, use body language, uh, facial characteristic, metaphor and analogy as much as if not more than, than rational, logical, lucid explanations because that won't work. Now it is the once every year Virgo full moon at about 3pm UK time on uh, sun, su Sunday, yes, yeah, Sunday the 12th of March. But it's a fairly healthy full moon and I don't see a major problem here as long as you're flexible and you allow change into your life. I can't tell you this is the best month of the year, but I can tell you that if you if you kind of relax into it and go with the flow, then as far as March 2017 goes, Virgo, it should be a changeable but stimulating month. <laughs>